So today, opening up a brand new tripod that I just got, bought it off Amazon. I've been using, I'm five seasons into filming now, and I've, I've been using a $20 Amazon tripod up until now. And honestly, other than it not having a fluid head on it, it just has a, I don't even know what it would be called. It doesn't move good. It catches a lot when you're trying to pan and uh, that's just, it just hasn't been a high priority for me to upgrade. But I just bought a new camera, upgraded to a uh, Sony FS5. As you can see, it's a pretty big camera in comparison to the uh, Canon G20, which I've been filming with for three years and that's what this video is done with just because I'm going to use this in this video. But anyways that the amazon tripod is just not sturdy enough to stabilize that big of a camera and i need to upgrade anyways by the way my name is ethan taylor with downtime outdoors uh, y'all can check us out i mean if you're watching this you can get to my page pretty easy but i've um, got a lot of hunts y'all can watch but anyways we're gonna get to it so the tripod that i'm going with is the care um shoot oh. Memory's terrible. It's the FP2450, I believe. Yeah, here it is right here. The KR FP2450 tripod kit. So, let's get this thing opened. Alright, so this is the box that it showed up at my door in. Which is a KR box. So, when you pull it out, we got this nice zip-up case. It has the option right here I see on the ends for a strap, like a shoulder strap. And you got your strap here. Uh, has a zipper on the front right here. Let's see if anything's in here. Okay, so in here we have instruction manual and it comes with three different uh, Allen head wrenches. I'm guessing there's something on here that you can adjust with that. And then you've got your base for the bigger cameras, which is my camera come with one of my new camera. Alright, let's see. I'll stick these right back in here. Let's open it up. Alright, so we have a piece here that's in a Ziploc bag. We've got you your uh, your handle. Places to put stuff. There's your shoulder strap I was talking about. And the tripod itself. Um by the way, something I meant to mention, this tripod I think I paid $99. It was like a little over a hundred, but I had Amazon Prime, so they gave me a discount. It was like $99 plus shipping and handling. I think it came out to like $106. Which is still a, if you really look into tripods, I guess a lower end tripod, but it's going to be an upgrade from anything that I've used. So, you pull, it's got a little, it's got your button right here. I'll do some zoomed in videos of this. Oh, I'm trying to see. So that just pushes in. Then you pull it out and you can just fold that thing up all the way like that so you get it to where you want it push that button in well i said it locks it there you go find that groove and then it does that so yeah find that groove push that in it locks it i know you can't see that right now but we're going to piece this together and then we'll do some videos of showing y'all how it works. Alright, so got it pieced together. Got the camera, uh, the handle on I mean. And then we have the camera put on. Now it actually, the this tripod come with two bases. It come with the base that I showed you earlier. 
in the uh, not the base the the piece that attaches to the bottom of your camera that's going to slide onto your fluid head come with two of them so now I have three of them because I had one that would come on the camera then it come with one extra one and then one that was already on the fluid head it also has it come with two separate options I know you can't see that but the piece that screws into the bottom of your camera it has a smaller option and a bigger option which this camera had options for both but I wanted the bigger one because it's a bigger camera but uh twist this back straight this your handle right here can go on either side so if, if you're left you know if you prefer your camera on your left side or you want it on the left side of the fluid head you can I prefer it on my right side because my LCD screen is on the left side of the camera so I don't know it just feels more natural to have it on my right side of the camera but anyways it seems to move really smooth um up and down is super smooth like I said this is an upgrade for me period so this could be a crappy one and I wouldn't even know it but I believe this is a pretty good fluid head and tripod um so right now this is in the like the center section is slid up I believe we can loosen that yep and that right there will slide down and then you can extend your legs right here if you want to it's got the three options like most tripods do but also let me tighten this back up slide this camera off and I want to show y'all one other thing so once that unscrews from right there once you get that unscrewed this right here will pull out completely from this you're going to leave that out stick that in your pocket now this leg of this tripod right here that has the rubber piece on it you'll see that there's a little gold like washer looking thing right there that's the one it unscrews unscrew that stick that there then you take that same leg screw it to the center piece that you just took out then you have a monopod that extends up to roughly around six feet if for some reason you need to have it on a monopod one stick that's a pretty cool feature i don't think that i will use it a ton maybe if you're on the go you know if you're running and gunning and hunting with something with you know you're just filming somebody it would probably be a good feature to have um But personally, I don't think I'll use it a lot, but it, like I said, it's a good feature to have. Overall, I think it's a pretty good tripod. Again, like I said, it's going to be an upgrade from what I have used. pretty happy with it I think it's gonna be a great tripod to use for hunting uh, gonna get have gonna have to get used to carrying a longer tripod it's a little bit longer once everything is compacted down I think it's around two foot once everything is put together oh um, but I'll strap it on my backpack some way I'm ready to put it to use next hunt this thing will go on well the first hunt will probably be a turkey hunt in about a month and a half so y'all check them out again this is the care fp 2450 tripod kit be sure to follow and subscribe to us on our social media accounts